It takes roughly 26,000 years for the axis to complete one full loop. As that happens, the North Celestial Pole drifts among the stars. A few thousand years ago, during the time of ancient Egyptian civilization, a different, relatively faint star in the constellation, Draco, lay near the pole. About 12,000 years from now, the bright star Vega will be the go-to northern marker. There will also be eras when no bright star sits conveniently close to the pole at all. So the idea of a single eternal north star is an illusion created by our short human time scale. Its central role in navigation is a feature of our particular historical moment, not a permanent property of the sky. In the end, the North Star is important not because the universe granted it special status, but because it exposes how much of astronomy is about correcting for our own perspective. It looks modest, yet it is an enormous, evolved supergiant, pouring out energy thousands of times faster than our sun. It anchors our sense of direction only because Earth's axis happens to line up near it right now, and that slow cosmic wobble means its reign is temporary. Its rhythmic variations participate in the cosmic distance ladder, helping us connect the scale of our local neighborhood to the scale of distant galaxies.